wishy-washy. You feel me? All of this, these people on here are wishy-washy. A lot of these hoes. They got somebody. He took God was talking to Nikki and them today. He understand them. It's this, that, and the third. Then he'll low key apologize to my son. Tell them, well, why don't you come do an interview? Let me talk to you. Then he'll talk to somebody else. The next day he'll be talking to Jasmine. It's all a game to them. This is not a game. I'm not playing with y'all. I'm being totally real with y'all. You understand? Even when I'm speaking, I'm gonna be. Even when I'm speaking to y'all out loud, I'm like. Michelle, why is you even mad about this? This is the game. This nigga never going to interview you and talk to you. His, the, the plan of the devil, the yoke of the devil was already destroyed because he tried to get Nikki and her mom to turn against me and say something bad on my name, and he couldn't do it. That destroyed him right there. That destroyed the interview. That destroyed it. He couldn't get them to do it. So even though he was like, people was in the comments like, yeah, you do that little bit of shit. Even his people, I think they was like, well, damn, they, where did Michelle come from? You always say that his people's claim is that I make things about me, but then you bring me up in something I didn't have nothing to do with. Make you like a joke, you dressing like a clown with a weird ass wig. I don't like that nigga. Man, I did say that. Like I said, I said I was walking and shit, but nigga, I said it. Don't you talking shit. about I can't get out. If it's caramel, you boy, you, whatever nigga you call on the phone, her ass was sitting on wild, just fresh shit. It ain't, no good, uh, it ain't no excuse for what I said. I was wrong on shit, make that shit right. Like what I said, like, you know what I'm saying? I realized that a little bit later when I calmed down. You know what I'm saying? Because we'll slide with that to my side. I don't care if it's little but, uh, I don't care if little was trolling. God, Zeus, I heard what he said. Uh, Michelle, 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 Michelle,
just admitted to that. Did you take him back after that? Was y'all still? I didn't know he was. I didn't know that he did that. Okay. Well, I'm gagging, honey. I'm gagging severely. This is just so much in my head. And, you know, I just don't, you know, as a woman, I just know that y'all, y'all have to feel some type of motherfucking way because I would just be, I would just be baffled. Like, I would just be blown away at this point. Like, I, I just, I don't really have much words, bitch. I don't really have much words. But I do thank you for my little friend. Right, Lo, you are not a woman. Take the W and the O off, you know, bitch. That's a man. Whatever. <laughs> All right, thanks, well. A dude. A nigga. A boy. <coughs> Balls, bitch. This whole shit ugly. Well, it's a lifetime of the crazy sex shit. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, y'all, come on. How, how y'all really expect me to feel? Y'all expect me to feel, like, sad about it? I guess y'all don't know me, first of all. <laughs> I guess y'all motherfuckers don't know me. I... When I'm done with somebody, I be done for real. Okay, I wasn't done. And yeah, no, we know you. He you said he wanted to bring me back and drag us out of nowhere for no reason. And I was just like, what the fuck? So I was like, yo, bro, I'm never helping this nigga again. From that point. Then he started saying. Girl, we already before. know how the and fuck I'm you is, bitch. You a sad ass hoe. That's why your skin is in a sunken place, Yetta. You got all them dark circles around your eyes looking like the Lord of Rings thinking you ended up giving me Jojo Siwa from fucking Nickelodeon. Bitch, after she cut her hair and she became the sweet life of Zack and Cody of Nickelodeon. Girl, if you don't sit your ass down over there looking like a lesbian version of Karen, sit your ass down, bitch. I was really done. That's what I was like, oh, let me go ahead and go to the fucking bail bonds and then take my motherfucking name off this shit. And you ain't gotta, you ain't gotta cost me $8,000. Like a hell no. Nah. And people say, people say, oh, you just mad because he wasn't giving you no dick no more. <laughs> You know I can get dick from any nigga I want. I have. I do. Shit. The fuck. It ain't about the dick. The fuck. No. It's about protecting my money. My motherfucking bag. Like, how is that not a good enough reason to take myself off the bond? Him threatening not to go to court. Like, I, like I'm not supposed to leave. Believe that he would leave the space. He's a criminal. Thank you. Of course he would. Why is she so obsessed? That's why I did it. This is also ooh, yeah, over there punching the air. You already out of jail. Ha ha ha. Yeah, the cops gonna be like. I didn't give a fuck about him being locked up. All I gave a fuck was I was off that motherfucker. Fine. If him going to jail was part of meeting all the bond, then so be it. But that wasn't my goal to send him to jail. My goal was to keep my name the fuck off that bond. And I did. So I didn't shit. <clears throat> yes, I was in love with that criminal once upon a time. Girl, you was just okay, a two that. weeks ago. What the fuck is your point? Money man, you really expect me not to be talking about the situation that I'm in because of your opinion? You can go fuck off and die. I will fuck. <laughs> All right, y'all, the next topic, because we think you're the stupid. So, Pumpkin you stop calling comes pumpkin. for... Pumpkin comes for Leah. Motherfucker, red ass oh, How dare you go out there and lay your nasty black ass down and get pregnant and know you a disrespectful bitch? Fucking come guzzling hoe. You know you ain't the type of bitch to get pregnant. You supposed to swallow and let them throw it in your face. Bitch, who the fuck you think you trying? Ryan, tear your ass up. I line you up off my whole thing and I read you down boots. Bitch, I give you a reality check while you over there trying to talk. You mad because he's wrong with it over here telling you the truth. Trifling ass bitch. You gonna get pregnant and you get kicked out every other motherfucking month. So now you gotta drag a dog, stroller, and everything else. Fucking black skin. I know everybody's favorite pet mom ain't motherfucking talking. This bitch can't even have no motherfucking. This bitch can't have no motherfucking kids. Her ex is fried, died, and laid to her side like that motherfucking kitten. And she gonna keep playing and God gonna take her other one with her sick ass. Bitch, I'm Oh, 
there crying. And I'll read you with straight facts. You ain't shit but a low life ass, little nasty ass bitch. All you got in your name is a raggedy ass, puckle ass cop. A motherfucking Scooby Doo ass, flipped on Scooby Doo Doo ass ass motherfucking cop. And I got that lace from. Ugly bitch. Got a lot of nerve, bitch. You can't talk about me. You can't say a. Bitch, 
bitch. I'm just being a good friend, bitch. Just like when I help get up, I'll just be a good friend. The fuck? Ain't shit funny about that. Y'all some fucking retards. You gotta wish you got a bold friend. Dangerous that you got in Vegas, cool it's so dangerous to drive in the hood. Kick anybody out of here that think that shit funny. It's that Where my ass is at? Anybody think that shit funny? Kick their fucking ass, because that shit's not funny. That shit not funny at all. I'm fucking 5'3", 140 pounds. Oh, in the fucking worst area of Las Vegas. At 3, 4 in the morning. Thank you, but I was just being a bold bitch. Trying to help a friend. So the whole point of this thing today was, because y'all kept telling me, do something. Y'all don't even already did something. So as of today, stop asking me to do something. Stop asking me, Barbie, you need to do this. But I already did. Worry about yourself. If you want to help her, that's her CA. You want to help her, that's her CA. Stop saying Barbie is Barbie. That I already did. I already did. I already helped. I did everything I can. Now, speaking of this girl, mental illness is real, y'all. And we have to start taking it serious on this app. Because a lot of these hosts are starting to lose their mind. Um, like, what's that bitch name, Monica? Dog.